Hello guys, this proof is in Canada. It is currently giving international workers job, okay? As you can see over here, I'm super excited when I saw this news, okay? All you have to do is to apply for it. So don't worry guys, I'll be showing you the step-by-step -step guide on how you can apply for this, okay? You don't need anything like IELTS. All you have to do is to apply. Please do it to watch the video from start to finish because I'll be showing you the step-by-step -step guide on how you can apply, okay? As you can see, the name of the province is Saxatwa. It said, the program name is International Skid Worker How to Feed Skis Pilot. Let's see the overview. Please refer to the website for future updates or changes to program intake depending on program demand. Threshold or caps may be implemented to manage the number of applicants under this pilot. I will advise you as I always say, as you are watching this video, please do where to apply for it, okay? This subcategory is for immediate and low skill workers in eligible high demand occupation who have an offer for a job in sector I mean the criteria of this subcategory he tend to reside in sector as permanent resident note all nominees with temporary work permit must reside in sector okay the eligibility for this program let's see have at least one one year of full-time work experience in the past three years in your intended occupation or a sector related occupation okay of six months which is 780 hours of full-time let's see all the layers look at all this first before we go over to other things have a language score of at least canadian language benchmark which is four okay as okay. so you can see the language requirement is very low so employers or regulators may ask for scores that are higher than clb4 the other requirement is your high school have completed secondary school high school or higher level education Nomination is issued for NOC 7300 transport truck drivers will be conditional on the proof of provided to SMP, SIMP that you have received the required licensing and endorsement. Okay, let's see. The last one is have a SMP approved offer for permanent or full time job in sector 12. You will need to Bali SMP job approval letter from your employer to show proof the offer must be in one of the following occupation. You can see shippers and receivers, stock keepers and pass person, dispatcher. These are the occupation. These are the NOC code. Then we also have other technician occupation in therapy and assessment, nursing aid, orderliness and patient associate pharmacy technical assistant and pharmacy assistant other assisting occupation in social aid services home support workers caregivers and related occupation hotel front desk clerk you can see they have different one light duty cleaners they have tr transport truck drivers they have heavy equipment operator they are construction trade and help us laborers. They have different different jobs. Okay. They said this pilot is not available to employer hiring support workers, caregivers and related occupations. NOC four four one zero one who reside in the client's residence or their place of work. That is they are not hiring living caregivers and the support workers okay he said seeking workers to reside in the client's house okay he said the program criteria can change at any time but we will use this we will use what was on the website when you receive your application 
the federal government said the amount of nomination the SNP can make every year. No application is guaranteed to be nominated. Your employer must meet the requirement to support your application and immigration through this pilot. The information can be found here. As you can see, this is it. How to fill skill pilot program employer requirements. I want to check or believe the link of this website in the description box okay who can apply to the hard skills let's see who can apply the following cannot apply refugee claimants in canada who are claiming refugee status from the government of canada you may not be eligible if you do not provide the required document at the time of submitting your application you were not able to prove that you plan to live and work in Saskatchewan. You and your representative have intentionally misrepresented yourself in the application. How to apply? You come here. So to apply to this pilot, you need a job offer to start your search. To start your search, please visit saskatchewanjob.ca. Your employer will need to provide you with a job approval letter from the SNP additional. Ensure that you follow the guidelines for application process. Complete scan and submit all required documents. Let's see. First of all, you need a job offer. That's the first thing. So you search for job here. Okay. From here. Sachs job. As you can see. From here. want to apply you can click these are jobs all these ones that you are seeing here all of them they are job site okay all of them they are job site you click on any of them and apply for the job okay anyone at all as you can see all of them they are jobs okay all of them they are job Let's see. Oh. Let's see. Search job. Let's see. Let's see. As you can see, these are uh, all the jobs. Okay. As you can see, seven thousand eight hundred and nineteen job posting. Insert at what today. Also, click. Let's see. These are the shops that is available today. Food court counter attendant. McDonald's restaurant. Okay. You can see 34 opening. There are so many jobs here. Kitchen helper. Drink caretaker. Wood counter attendant, McDonald's restaurant as well. We also have shop assistant. They are the living truck driver. Okay. Anyone you are interested in, you can just apply for it. Okay. Any of them at all. You can apply for it. As you can see. They have different different jobs here. These are all jobs, okay? Let's take for instance, you want to apply for food counter. See? Employer name is McDonald's Restaurants. Contact name is Angela. Contact email, as you can see. This is your email. The salary is what? 30.50. Posted date was 21st September 2021, which is yesterday. Position number of position is 34 vacancies. Experience you see, no experience is needed. Zero to six months, no experience is needed. How to apply? You should apply before 21st October 2023. How to apply? You send resume to angelas at gmail 
gmail.com which is this gmail address okay this is where you will send your resume and uh, what is it called application letter okay you have to send your resume and your application letter as well as you can see these are all the job that is this is this one you don't need anything like experience as you can see over here boot counter you see you don't need anything like experience let's go to another one let's go to kitchen happen just use all the job first of all migrate first okay so you can see this one is also one mark work employer address is what in one mark is sacks at work Canada. this is your contact name john w wonk contact phone number if you know you want to call them directly you can call them then their email okay this is how to apply you don't also need any t experience okay how to apply say so apply in person with resume okay you are looking for kitchen apart for a position in restaurants okay you know what you want to apply let's look at shop attendance or oh, go down look for another one there are so many jobs here they have admin accounting payroll administrator let's see position solely one apply before 21st of september how to apply trusted candidate interested in this position can visit this website that you will visit okay just click on it it will take you to how you can apply for it okay this is it these are all the jobs they have different different job okay So have cleaning job okay I want to check something like this uh delivery truck driver let's see he said also no experience is also needed as well they say you can apply by person or you can apply by email to info there's the email here okay the location is regina okay is in region say why go recycling seeking for an operator driver apply for this position will be required at least one year experience of driving trucks and trailer in driving as what is needed please bring your resume to blah 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 or email to info please mention for which job you applied okay you have your truck license there's a way to apply for this job okay let's go down there are different different jobs here different different jobs posting all those websites that you saw there all of them they are for job they also have construction worker click no experience is needed at all no experience is needed if you want to apply to apply to this place okay also have a website as well no experience is needed okay. let's go back There's so many jobs here also come here let's see Just click it and apply. There are so many jobs over there. Okay. What you need to know about using immigration representative. This is everything you need to do. You do not need to use immigration representative or consultant to apply. If you choose to use a representative, you must make sure they are a lawyer in canada in good standing with a provincial 
society in license by government of South Tekwa. You don't need any immigration or any consultant or any agent to help you apply for it as you see over there. You can apply all by yourself, okay? He said for other forms and information, request for a nomination revision or a nomination extension form cannot be used to license. Please, I will be leaving the link of this website in the description box below. Please do where to apply for it, okay? There are so many jobs there. There are so many jobs there, okay? You need to apply. What are the required documents? You must provide all forms and documents to prove you are eligible for SNP nomination at the time that you submit your application. You will also need this document to prove your identity, work experience, academic materials, language, ability. The SNP may also ask for more documents that are not listed, okay? First of all, general guidelines, a copy of original document, a copy of English or French translation, a copy of an affidavit from the translator, blah blah blah, okay? Required forms, as you can see, these are all of them. Also, from the required document, what are the required document? Number one is a job offer, okay? Number one is job offer. Number two is language criteria. Number three is your education, which is your high school. But first, your work experience at least one year or six months. And then, number five is temporary work permit if applicable. Number six is proof of residence if applicable. Number seven is credentials uh, if applicable. Number eight is identity and civil status document that one is mandatory number nine is a passport all right guys see you in my next video